All right, it's finally happened in my favor here. Kingdom Hearts was finally able to be brought into my collection. Uh, it took a lot of added time due to a lot of financial priority that was forced to be done elsewhere through the time between January and February and parts of March. But time makes all things possible in the end. I made my post out on Game Facts here regarding the latest addition to my present gaming options as well as the next big thing I want to happen for my YouTube channel's general growth. This is Kingdom Hearts 3. I featured Kingdom Hearts in a lot of earlier segments before Kingdom Hearts 3 was trending and became a thing during the eSports events. So I look forward to adding a lot of things here from Kingdom Hearts 3 to my collection once I get a chance to play this more. Slowly I'm going to be playing Kingdom Hearts once I reach a steady point with Arkham Knight and finish taking my second leave of Overwatch's competitive community as of March 2019. For right now I want to see this opener real quick.
All right, I got what it is I wanted to see here. It was a good decade, and that was worth the wait to see on my own TV screen here. All those key moments shown throughout the past games I remember featuring across my YouTube channel a couple years back. Unfortunately, not Dream Drops Distance like I was hoping I could, as I haven't had a second chance to really get my copy of that game, so I can see not just the story's next piece in full at that time of what's important of the timeline of Kingdom Hearts, but also get a scope for this boss fight that was hidden away in that game. All the same, I'm very satisfied. The cover right here, I really like this. It's... The, top, the, the art right here on the title screen is very reminiscent of Kingdom Hearts 1's remix, I think, with Sora that's standing on the waterfront of Destiny Islands. I like the detail that they put into that. This next scene coming up with Xehanort and Ericus talking it was a very nice scene. I loved this a lot, and I liked a lot of these views when I first saw this when it dropped. Have you heard of the ancient Keyblade War? Huh? Of course I have. Long ago... Keyblade wielders waged a war over the ownership of light. Yeah, the Master's favorite story. I wonder what they planned on doing with Kingdom Hearts after... making it appear. Who knows? I don't get why anyone would initiate a war. So... You know the Lost Masters. Who? They're the ones who started the Keyblade War. Never heard of them. Where'd you hear about that? Or... They're the ones for whom... The war started. I'm not following you. You can drop the facade. Facade? On that land shall darkness prevail and light expire. A prospective Keyblade Master should know this. If you say so. The gazing eye sees the fate of the world. The future. It's already been written. Really? I'm not so sure about that. Besides, who's to say I can't change it? And maybe light will prevail. <laughs> Pretty confident. But things aren't in your favor. Perhaps, but unlike darkness, there is more light than meets the eye. You might be surprised. Oh, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> 